Well, thank you very much. That was fun. There's a pond over there. Don't drive the truck into it. <laughs> I have gone back to school maybe not like the old Rodney Dangerfield no. movie we're not having all sorts of parties and stuff but we are learning about uh, well kind of the auto program that they have down here at Fox Valley Technical College in terms of uh, the the semis the over-the-road driving things of that nature they have a truck driving diesel equipment mechanic exploring auto collision and refinishing careers and exploring automotive careers in general that's the first thing about the difference between the gas and the Okay. Then there is a... It's really hard to jump the gun. <laughs> We're at Fox Valley Technical College down in Appleton. Mike Norder here from Schneider's with me. And uh, Mike, you're ahead of the marketing and, and not recruitment, but we want to talk about drivers needed. Driving down here, I was talking with Harry and Bonnie, who's our chaperone. And I must have seen three employers on the way down here looking for drivers. What's the market out there for drivers? Uh, absolutely. I, I drove down from Green Bay as well, and I had to listen to Bill on the drive down, which was unfortunate. <laughs> As you think about the truck driving industry, you know, America has really slowly uh, come through the recession and jobs are starting to become more available. One of the sectors that is growing incredibly is truck driving. Uh, depending on what industry analysts you talk to today, there's anywhere from a 25,000 to 100,000 nationwide driver shortage. So there are plentiful jobs available as truck drivers, especially here in Northeastern Wisconsin.